the Nubian Prince and I'm back at you with another take from the two-part series of how to stay longer in bed or in the bedroom department. Um, with this one I would like to carry on where I left off with the different things that us guy can try or use these tips or these tricks and we can gain much time on, on the clock and also more pleasure at the same time. Bravo! So I just dropped on a few t uh, few more tips and I always go off at the top of my head and the, the next one in line I would think that we men we are to know and it's the key thing and it's our strokes number. As men we are to know like at what point in, in the making love or in the sex we know that that's our number coming up where we're gonna bust that nut or something like that. We are to know that number because you don't just like, oh, oh my God, I'm sorry. And it just, you know, it doesn't work like we are to know our number. So if that number is probably 50 or 35 and you know you're at 32, you need to just, you know what I mean? Just like give it, give it a walk, you know what I mean? It's like, do you bow out and just go and kiss some fresh air and come back and get back into the saddle, you know what I mean? We are to know our number. Okay, our number is quite crucial. The next thing I think we can do as well especially if the woman is quite brand new to you as well is to lay off the gadgets because a lot of times like if she's more accustomed to the gadgets sometimes she might be favored the gadget than how she favor you sometimes so you can have her to lay low off like, the gadgets as well and even if you're a gadget man as well you need to the, the aim here is to bring in the impression that you are the thoroughbred, you're the man in charge here not just the, the gadgets like the the dildo or the what kind of gadgets that you guys might want to be using up in that bedroom so you can just lay low off of that until you establish yourself as the thoroughbred man in that department and the next thing I can look at as well fellas is if we can allow her to come first that would be an awesome brownie points for us you know what I mean because that take off a lot of strain off for us in terms of the performance and all of that kind of hectic build up of everything that expecting of us because sometimes if you give her the right nut sometimes trust me probably she can end up like even sleeping or too tired for you to go now and you know I mean, put on your own performance for the night or for the evening who knows you know what I mean so it's good if we can you know what I mean psychologically play the mind game and have her to have her moment in time before even us you know what I mean so that take off a lot of strain off of us as you know what I mean we know sometimes if you know that time is against you sometime if you was to hit it that way you know what I mean and the next thing I think that we can do as well as fellas we are to know our signature move because take for example Michael Jordan he got his move on the basketball ground he just don't gonna bounce but he got his move so as we have to have our own moves your move can resemble the other guy next door or the other guy down the street you have to got your own signature move you know what I mean something special man you know what I mean you know it you know what I mean we all have to have our own signature move in the bedroom department that sets you apart from every other dude that she might know of, heard of, or even aware of. You know what I mean? You have to be that thoroughbred with that move. You know what I mean? Trust me. Just like David Beckham. If you can bend it like him, then you already did David Beckham for her. You know what I mean? I'm just saying. And the next thing again, a thing that we can look at as well is find loads of way to bring in fun, excitement, in the bedroom department loads of different things it could be cards you know what I mean play different games that bring excitement because women like to be stimulated not just via the they are a sexual organ but she like to be stimulated by the mind so if you can bring like a freshness to the game bring fresh dynamics to the bedroom because that would help to spark the fire more you thinking you was there for a minute and by the time you know two hours spent, you know what I mean? You even touch it yet. But like I said, the different kind of tricks that you might take from your own bag of the medicine is like time is fly, you don't even know it, you know what I mean? So bring new dynamics, bring new creativity, bring new things to the to the table because the more creative you are as a man is the more time gonna be lost like lots like that and you know not 
where the time goes, you know what I mean? So, because if time is the essence for those fellas who, you know what I mean, who have difficulty with staying, the, the, the staying time, you know what I mean? We have to find new ways, new ideas, and new creativities of doing it. And the one, the one which I esteem one of the best one for us as well, fellas, like I said, especially if it's a new date, whatever, the new girl as well, if you could probably go to have her to come to your place because what happened if you go to her own place there's a lot of tension and i mean nervousness and all of that gonna be stuck against you so it's like a playing a game away from home if you play her on your own turn your own turf on your own terms and condition then you are in control but if it was to go to her place or something like that then you feel a bit you know what i mean not cool with yourself because you have to take time to get comfortable and readjust to her own environment or you can probably get a neutral environment as well could be like i said also qualified to take her to a hotel or something like that you can do that at another viable option you know what i mean but like i said if you take her away from her from her own environment then you have you have the upper hand you know what i mean and sometimes that's what we need to do and like i said in a psychological terms and condition you can flip the switch you know what i mean because flip switch is quite cool man if you can play it like that so if you adopt these principles or these these tricks or trick tips or tricks then i can see where it can heed or can heal you good result you know what i mean because these are tested and tried by not just others but also by myself and like i said the trust me the dividend is splendid you know what i mean so <laughs> you can try fellas and trust me you can drop me a comment and tell me how did they work for you and if you if they got new ones that are quite exciting as well because like i said as men we need to know so we can share with each others and bring in that harmony and share the the, the, the secret because it's not a secret for me only because everybody out there want to be the best thing thereof in terms of the bedroom department so whatever we have fellas feel free even sisters as well who want to come in and drop something on a conversation in the comment area feel free to drop that comment there as well feel free to hit the subscription button as well and also thumb up the video as well and also tell it to your friends and your families as well and thank you very much one more time to stay tuned to the newbie prints and thank you to listen to part one and also part two now peace Thank you.